Alright, so I'm going to be showing off an application. I did a, a video previously about Twitch streaming straight from your NVIDIA Shield tablet without the need, or sorry, NVIDIA Shield portable. Don't want to insult the portable by calling it the tablet, sorry. Uh, no, but seriously, I, don't, I did a video on how to Twitch stream direct, directly from the portable using Twitch with uh, using an application called SCR Broadcaster which you needed to be uh, signed up as a tester, as a beta tester on Google Plus or whatever the hell to in order to use. It didn't have internal audio, it was very simple and did not really offer a heck of a lot. However, there is an app that has been around for quite some time and wasn't really working until recently there has been an update to this application and I'm going into the wrong folder and it is screen stream mirroring not the best name on the planet earth but it's a really awesome app and checking services root and this will stream not only to Twitch but as well it will stream to YouTube, Ustream and whatever else you have you can set up with a custom server thingy whatever you can have your preference so you can set up you can stream in HD in yeah 720p I think even 1080p but you'd need a really good connection for that on top of that you can also stream your screen to things like Chromecast uh, VLC music player web browsers whatever you see here um, you can record the screen I wouldn't really use this for a screen recorder. It doesn't have the best frame rates. It's not like SCR Pro or Shao when it comes to frame rates. But as far as streaming, um, the streaming it's kind of similar. Like you know, the frame rates are, are definitely acceptable. It's just that other apps get better frame rates, but they don't have as many features. And the like I said, the frame rates are completely acceptable. Um, so here we are with Twitch. I have Twitch set up. So now Twitch is easy to set up. Uh, you go into the settings and then it gives you an option if you want to just Twitch. You have it will put that in your notifications. You can just go into your app and then hit play. It will tip it'll stream straight to Twitch once you set everything up. Um, so um, in order to stream to Twitch, you need, you know, you have to select, you just have to go into this menu, select the closest server to you, which for me is in New York. Uh, so I selected that. And then you just need your stream key, which I believe it will actually even take you straight to Twitch, to the page where you get your stream key, and you just copy and paste it right into here. And then it will actually just, you'll be kind of ready. You just want to select your you know, like your resolution depending on <clears throat> how good your internet connection is. I had something stuck in my throat. And, uh, yeah, uh, I found that the best uh, encoding format for this Shield Portable was 4.1 for frame rate. And it also gives you some interesting options once you select that, but I don't want to use any of them because I just don't. There's, a like, a video effect your live video effect, you get uh, grayscale, cycling colors, excuse me, heat color, sepia, you know, all these different filter kind of things. So that's cool. So you can stream with all these weird colors or whatever. Um, and you know, it's just simply that there's, it, it supports internal audio. It supports internal audio and microphone, but for the shield, I've had a little trouble where if I plug in a headset, which is normally what you would want to do because the mic is here, and if you're pressing buttons on the shield, it picks it up and like drowns out your vocals and it's very annoying. So it's not really an optimal setup. Uh, and if you plug in a headset, it will actually start, it will not record the internal audio. It'll just mute the internal audio and then you won't be able to have both. So that's the main issue I had with that, I found. Uh, the only thing I could think of is to pair another controller, other than the Shield tablet controller, pair a controller that doesn't have a mic input, and basically just use the, the built-in mic 
with the internal audio, but use a controller, you know, that's paired or like an Xbox 360 controller so that the, when you press buttons, it's not right next to the mic and, you know, just do that for, bleh, for Twitch streaming and I'm spitting all over the place. Um, but so far, that seems to be a specific issue with the Shield devices, I guess, just from talking to the developer. But I'm going to go ahead and stream to Twitch. I've streamed to YouTube with this, and it's very buggy. Uh, YouTube, if that's just YouTube, streaming is shit. I've seen people with amazing uh, internets, internet connections, get crappy uh, streams to YouTube. So that's just YouTube's uh, streaming service sucks. But we will do something here. Hit... And then now we're going to be streaming to Twitch, uh, or we're going to be crashing. That 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 could happen too. But let's try this again. Uh, let's hit play. And hopefully this. Yep. Yeah, there we go. Now I'm going to zoom out. And a little bit of. Uh, I didn't realize the screen was so bright like that. Uh, sometimes it looks like terrible there, and then not so much. Yeah. So. I brought it up as you see here. This is my desktop. I'm going to bring down the, the. Oh, I can't. Oh, yeah, I can bring down the brightness. <laughs> it's not impossible. Um, uh, let's see here. Try to. Come on. You can do it. There you go. All right. So, as you see, I'm streaming now to Twitch. Let me lower the brightness on this as well, because it seems a little bit too much, too bright, and I may be lowering it too much. I don't know. It's hard to tell with this camera. Brightness. Lower it a bit. All right. As you see, there's a little bit of a delay like normal, but uh, you can now... That's just my desktop streaming from uh, with Splashtop, but now I can actually go into a game... Or I can stream from within the game using the notifications. And I can pick whatever game I want. Say Asphalt 8. Or whatever. And more like normal there's some delay going to Twitch. But as you see we are streaming. The Shield Portables um, display to Twitch. And this is being done in 720p. Uh, I believe the bitrate is... What is it? 4,000... Yeah. I'll show it to you. Zoom. Hear the sound. The sound's not going to come out of here because it's capturing the internal sound and when it does that it mutes the sound. So it will, however, come out of the tablet speakers. Volume. Oh wow, it's kind of low. <laughs> Anyways, so you hear that. I thought I already went through this process here. I guess I didn't. Oh, wait, you know what? I think I played on the tablet. And then, yeah. Oh, yeah, there we are. Streaming to Twitch. YouTube is a bit more complicated and it seems like too much of a long walk for a small drink of water. Um, it's just pointless. It just, you get all these, all this uh, artifacting on the screen no matter what resolution you select, it just isn't watchable. And I really wish it was because if you have like more people that watch you on YouTube than Twitch, which I don't think I really have anybody that watches me on Twitch, then it would probably make more sense for you to stream onto YouTube and it would be nice a nice convenience so that you can interact with your subscribers and all that fun stuff. But, uh, yeah, who the hell wants to watch a fucked up uh, stream with nothing but macro blocking and, and weird gray streaks across the screen and stuff like that and all this weird stuttering noises. But, I'm going to do... I'm going to pick up the... This is a live stream. I'm going to pick up the uh, tablet or the the shield portable.
And I'm just going to try to play some games here. No, I do not want to learn how to play. I know I suck, all right? Okay. Just try to reposition the cameras. Okay, okay. join room. I like Infected. Nobody really seems to understand how epic Infected is, and they're just stupid. All right. Next time you get into an online match, if you get into this game, select Infected. It's a hell of a lot better than anything else in the game. I only select two laps because everybody else does. I never, I'm never able to get three laps because they just want to play like a, a short game or something. But whatever. I don't think I've ever played this uh, this course. Is that a new course or is that old? I don't remember seeing it. So, well, it's time to play like shit, and you get to see me stream it online. Twitch. Just zoom into the tab a little bit more. Not too much. Oh, wow. No, I don't think I played this. I'm going to sit down now. <laughs> sitting there looking, I can't hear anything. I'm like, oh yeah, that's right, I can't uh, hear anything because of the streaming. Yeah, yeah, that's it. Okay, so I know nothing of this course. Looks kind of like a wipeout course or something. So I'm going to play, like, complete ass. Please say wipeout, or zero, something like that. I don't know. Doesn't quite look like the usual. I like it. I just can't play it because I've never played it before. Yeah. Oh, that's awesome. I like that. It's almost like, kind of like the thing in Mario Kart, uh, Wii. Oh shit, no. Fuck. Oh, by the way, you're going to, of course, see me complaining about stuff that hasn't happened yet, where, you know, from what you're looking at. <laughs> I didn't even realize that. I'm sitting there like, what do you mean, fuck? You didn't, you didn't crash yet. <laughs> now, I'm not really trying, by the way, so if you're wondering. And if, oh, by the way, because I'm streaming using Splashtop, you're not really getting the the actual frame right there that for a splash top is a, as good as it is it's a little choppy compared to what I don't know even compared to the actual desktop the only reason I'm using splash top is because I can't get the twitch stream to show up natively I don't know what the fuck, where I'm going. <laughs> what? Whatever. See, there I am complaining about something that hasn't happened yet. You'll see it soon. There it goes. Looking at the tablet screen now. And that's what I bitched about. And what is it? Last place. Yeah. So, anyways. That's that. Um, just wanted to show you the application. Promised I'd uh, I'd share it and stop being a fucking lazy prick, and there it is. So that's screen stream mirroring. I will leave it. Uh, I will leave a um, link in the description. Apologize for my um, the way I'm speaking, which is a little confused. Um, I'd like to blame it on my intoxication, but I'm not intoxicated. I only had one vodka, and that's not enough. So I have no excuse for being incoherent. Anyways, so as you see, we hit stop. And mirroring is stopped. And it should stop soon on Twitch TV. Or whatever. It should. There you go. So there you go. Thank you for watching.